Good morning, good morning. Welcome to my channel. Today we're going to use the word angel. It's a dictionary page. Um, I thought using the word angel was really good for us today since it's the season of Christmas and I know here in Australia, um, angel is used as a tree topper, and I just thought it might be good. So I've cut out an angel, I've mod podged it, and I really love this. I just thought that would sit really well with it, but we're going to do a bit of deck, decking out, I don't know, but we shall see. Um, just seeing what else I can put there. Mm -mm 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 -mm. This is when you look for your scraps and really, really um, try and make them work for you. And that's what I'm trying to do here. Because normally with this sort of stuff, we look at limited supplies, you know, because that's what we're working on, um, limited supplies. So that's what I thought I'd do it with the angel. So what I might do is, is some glue. Like keep things simple. That's what I try and do when um, I do my dictionary pages. I keep them as simple as possible. And um, create from there, you know. Find a focal point, which is your angel. Find something that you can actually lay down. As a secondary focal point uh, to lift the angel up and I just thought this might be appropriate I quite like it um, I just think it looks good it looks good then I thought I will so that will be on the outside. So I thought before I glue down the angel, I would um, lay some cheesecloth and make sure you pull at it. So you're giving it that fray, fray look. And Take it across its feet if you can of the angel and I don't know if I really wanted it that side but it doesn't matter there then get some more glue make sure you do it glue it down properly especially if you've mod podge something you always make sure it's glued down properly if you happen to use mod podge don't forget to use your um acrylic spray if you're concerned that the humidity is going to make it sticky normally though if you buy the matte mod podge you won't have that issue So I want it to sort of lay it there. Isn't that gorgeous? I really, really love doing my dictionary pages. And look, I'm sorry I'm late with it. So, um, I had a bit going on. And just sometimes, you know and I know, we just can't get to things when we really want to. 
been trying to keep up with some projects, some I have a hard time with um, doing. Um, I tried to complete a journal, which I was really happy about. I am feeling slightly better um, to what I have been, but still got a long way to go. But I'll get there, you know. Like I said, with everything, it's tiny steps. With junk journaling, it's tiny steps. Um, I'm not sure. I just wanted to fray this a bit. As well before I lay it down just add a bit of color just nice adding color to your page I hope you can see what I'm doing and I'm just gonna lay it here Just didn't fray as much as I want it to, but you can pick at it till it does. And then I want it to lay that over it. Like I said, I'm just keeping things simple these days. Um, not overthinking. I'm just laying out the page and hoping that this will work for me and it, look it generally does um i hope you guys are going to start doing lynn's challenge um for the month of december the first week i haven't started yet lynn but i will um I love doing my December daily. Um, Lynn's made it easy for us. So she's made it so that it's uh, uh, more of a... Uh, what do you call it? Um, I did have a little angel here somewhere. Where did my angel escape to? Because I did have one. I think you're organised and you're not. Um, and I was organised before I started the page. So let's see if we can find an angel. Which I honestly had one out. It's like I got somebody here that takes away my stuff like that guard um it's got it in here because I have not moved anything away since I opened the page so where's my angel Oh, there it is. There it is. So. I want to put this there. Just another little bit of a dressing. And then I'm going to stick my angel down. I 
don't really want that to be really super thick so I'm going to move move it a bit and let me stick it down and then I thought I might add I don't know something else so excuse my arm but I'm thinking of adding I did have a lighter I did have a lighter I just want to get, I want the page complete sorry I'm thinking of adding a I thought we might add, since these have fallen out of the bag, a red for Christmas. For a bit of bit of colour, I'm just going to have to be careful that this book might be a bit too heavy. So we'll put this box up a bit. Look, I try. I honestly try not to overthink my pages. Sometimes I believe we overthink them. Look, and, and we've got to do, when we junk, we've got to do what's right for us. And that really means not overthinking the process. Um, like I said, this is a dictionary page. I try and keep it as simple as possible. Um, because an angel, I found an angel. Um, I got it from the world of muchness on... Um, Etsy. So I, I believe her name is Amanda Taylor. Or Lorna Taylor, sorry. <coughs> I think it is. I'm sorry if I got the name wrong, but it's World of Muchness. That's her did you? I'm using. This is from Jar from Medieval. And I just felt that something's missing there, so this is why I'm going to do. A, um, I don't know what they call them now. I tell you, sometimes my brain does not function like it should because my mind runs a mile a minute of what to do next, you know, what's um, what's going to um, look good for me. So I just thought I would lay the red for Christmas. And I'm sort of I'm gonna put it all down. <laughs> Let's hope it turns out all right, guys. Like I said, I don't muck around with these much because it's just not like I don't think about it, you know. Because I seen the box lying there and the candle still up there from a project I did in the past, and I never put it away. So now all I do is just let it sit there and let it do its thing. And, um, gee, I hope I had my initial the right way because that actually says G. Um, these are a fun little projects to do. Um, I, I keep it simple for a reason. And I always utilise what's on my desk because I feel that's what's going to work for me. Um, you don't have to do it my way. You can draw an angel. You can put a wing up, which um, I've got one sitting here, which can signify an uh, angel. I don't know how long that takes to dry. Oh, it worked. And 
I might get a bit of bling because I can. Um, you know, if that if that's what I want to do. And that's what I want to do, you know, um, just to add something else to my project. But it's where I want to put it is what's going to count. I might put it there. It's not my best page, but I just decided that I'm not overthinking, you know. Overthinking gets me nowhere. Um, I'm not sure about that, so I'm just going to, I don't know, no, that pink's not really doing it for me, I don't know if it's doing it for you guys, but for me it's not, so I'm going to, we've got a bit of scrap lacy bits here. That I can actually um, put there if I want to. Um, a little bit more of this white. I can I can snip into it and fray it. Then it might do something for me. And, and this is what it's all about, you know. If it doesn't look good. Add more layers. Oh, I'm just that sort of person that sometimes, yeah, I overthink, but I find it's better if I don't and just to fix it um, if I feel it doesn't look right. No, that's going to look better, I think. So I'm just going to get a bit more of that. And um, look, it's just a top. A top that I've... I've cut up and cut up and cut up and I, I just keep utilising it till it does something for me. You know, when I, if I make a boo-boo and it doesn't look right and that sort of thing. And um, I will lay my, um, I'll stick it down. Like the pink looks good there, it just doesn't look good there. So, easy fix. And it just seems to complement that white that we got there. And that fades out the pink a bit. And I love these fraying bits. I'm not cutting them all off because I actually like them, but I'll tidy them up. So that's our angel page. Um, yeah, um, that's dried really perfect. Just want to make sure the angel is stuck down. And I just think that's quite cute. Like for me, that's cute. Now, if you haven't got an angel, you can add wings, you can add a star. Angel can mean lots of things. Here it says it's, the, it's a divine messenger, visits like those. Um, and far, this is a real old book. Short and far between, entertain, unawares. Do service to one who proves to be an important person, etc. Lovely or innocent being, minister of loving offices, old English gold coin in full, noble, from 6x, 8d to 10s, showing Michael, piercing dragon, good, evil, tendance, spirits, messenger of death, Fish kind of shark, devils or horseback, savoury, 
of oysters wrapped in slices of bacon, if if la angels. Wow, that's a bit different, isn't it? But this is what it means for me. So that's what I go off. What something means for me. So make sure it's fully stuck down. I tend to use fabric glue for all my um, junking. I like the way it, the pages look. And um, I don't know. But to me, that's quite cute for me. You can deepen the flower lines um, by lightly. No, that's too too thick. So you find a finer pen. That's not the one either. So I just really finely and then I'll just I just want to define it a little bit because you can't really see its outline. So just don't overdo it. And then I should have a charcoal pencil here. But I bet you it's gone missing. Like everything else. <laughs> Story of my life. But, yeah, just real lightly. Like if I had my watercolours up, I would have actually done a bit more of a, a thing to it that I haven't, so I'm just utilising what I got. And this is the thing with Duncan, you utilise what you got, you just try and work with what you got, because that's what it's about. It's not about being perfect, junk journaling isn't meant to be for perfect, just meant to utilise it in such a way that it works for you, you know what I mean? A dictionary page is good for a newbie. It's good for somebody who just wants to do a quick page. And, and that's what I use it for. So, let's lift the flower up a little bit. And there's our angel with the mistletoe. And we've got a little gold angel there. We've covered up the pink. That was a bit of a mistake. So, like I said, it doesn't have to be perfect. So, angel for today, everybody. Um, I hope you have a lovely week. We're, we're actually Thursday here, so we're actually coming up to the close of our weekend. And... Um, Christmas, as you know, it's really basically two and a half, three weeks away, really. So there you go. I just put a bit more of that cheesecloth around the feet. Thank you very much for tuning in. I'm not perfect at this. Like I said, everything's new for me too when I start something new and as time will go on, we'll, we will get better at it. Needs a bit of glue there. So you do it how you want. Because that's what I do with my junk. And I do it how I want. How it suits me. How it's going to look for me. How it's going to make me feel. And I like that page. Oh, it's not perfect. But it's not meant to be. But thanks for watching and um, I'll see you next time.